Hey, what's going on guys? Today's video, I'm gonna be discussing how to screencast, mirrorcast your cell phone to your television. And there, the contrast is a little bit better there. So I have an S8 Plus in my hand, and this video will show you how to do it. First thing you probably did is buy your Amazon 4K stick, which I have connected over here. You're like, how do I mirror my phone? It should be just as easy as Google. What's going on? Almost gets you to a frustration. As you can see, it's literally mirroring my phone here. So let me show you a cool feature that I actually have fired up right here. Let me show you my garage right now. So I have my garage there and you're like, oh, okay, that still sucks. There's a bunch of black. Well, obviously you just flip it this way and that is my security camera in my garage. And I just wanted something way over the top. So I was just trying to learn how to connect this while I'm upstairs, let's say, and I can literally, if I have my garage door open, I can see what's going on on my 60 inch Samsung or my phone. I mean, it's just, again, it's way over the top, but I'm showing you a couple other really cool things that you can do. Now you have to download an app on your Fire TV stick. Let me go ahead and show you that real quickly. I think you just stop screening once you're done. Let's try the home button to stop screen capturing. There we go, okay. So I hit the home button and screen capturing stop. So let's start from square one and let's go ahead and go. So what you do is you just hold down and you say mirror cast apps. And then you obviously just choose. I'm gonna go ahead and hit that one. And the one I downloaded was air screen right here. Air screen right there. It only has two and a half stars at 146 and you're like, that's rubbish, that's horrible. Well, a lot of people, unfortunately, it's not as easy. That's why I'm making this video. So let's go ahead and click on that one. Okay, this is why I think it got a little bit of downgraded stars, okay? So you do have to download it. So there'll be a little cue to go ahead and download it. And I have it already downloaded. And then go ahead and fire it up and then it'll walk you through the directions. There's giving you many different options. I chose Google Cast. The very first one, there's also video tutorials. There's also Miracast, uh, DNLA, I believe, AirPlay or something like that. I just chose the first one. You guys, if you're familiar with the other ones, go ahead and choose those ones. Anyway, so once that is fired up, then you come over. Now you do have to download with the one I chose. You have to download the Google Home app. And of course, that would be for Android, but you can do this with the iPhone. You just have to choose your device, Android, iOS, Windows, etc. It's all on the directions of that app right there. So let's come on down here real quickly here. Once you have downloaded the Google Home app, then down here at the bottom here, I'm going to go ahead and hit this little icon right there and then directions set up here. I gotta be a little careful because my email address is right on the top there. And as we can see here down towards the bottom, it says additional. So we're gonna go ahead and hit mirror device. And it says right here, this device is not optimized for casting, so your experience may vary. So that's just a little warning here. So you go ahead and hit OK. And again, this is all in the directions, but I did notice that the name of this I think is a little different than the directions on the TV. So you just cast two, it's gonna be this name right here. And then you go ahead and hit that, it says connected, and then the app fires up if you're not already in, and bada bing, bada boom. What's showing on my phone is showing on there. So we fired up YouTube, and it looks like we are casting just beautifully there. We can of course watch all sorts of videos. I'll leave that up to you guys. And then once it is playing, obviously then throw it sideways, or hey, look at that, you can even throw it sideways right now, and you can cast it up real nicely. Of course, there's a slight delay, but not much at all, really. Just maybe a few seconds there, where one is delaying and the other one is going. Anyway, I just wanted to show you that quick video, guys, because it's pretty cool, especially if you bought your Amazon 4K stick. Why can't I mirror cast? The old Amazon stick, not the 4K one, could mirror. Why can't I mirror? Again, Amazon is just doing its Amazon thing. But smash the thumbs up button if it has helped you figure out if this is something you want to tackle. Again, you got to download a few things, but it's all on the instructions. It's all legitimate stuff. It's not anything stupid, viruses that you have to download and worry about this stuff. This is all through Amazon's App Store and, of course, 
the Google Play Store for the Google Home app. That's how I use it. Smash that thumbs up button, subscribe to the channel. I also have a lot more videos on the channel about the Amazon 4K stick, what I think about it, other products, the new third generation Alexa, which is right over there. You guys have a wonderful day. We'll see you on the next one. Happy screencast, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.